Welcome viewers, Glorung here, back with another episode of The Rise of the Witch King, The Battle from or The Battle from Middle Earth 2, The Rise of the Witch King, War of the Ring. Men of the Riddermarks! Be careful! There are spiders near. Spiders near soldiers. Someone's attacking, looks like. Did they get through? Oh, the enemy opened up my ally opened the gates for some reason. Well, one battalion of um, knights should be able to take care of them. People watch the line. What are you doing? Put them from these lands. And I believe did we defeat one of the enemies? Yeah. But I. I think all he has left is a builder. Raiders of the Mark! Could be wrong. Okay. Just remembering my hockey. Rohirrim! Reclaim this land and for the king! Wow. Oh, cave toys. Fortunately, they're all goblins, so even though there are a lot of them, they don't they aren't very so, semi safe. Oh, they're actually going to do anything with it, most likely. So let's trample these guys who say they're resistant to trample. And they all die, surprise, surprise. I don't know why, what it means when it says they're resistant to trample. Fortress, yes. Oh, and I have the ivory tower for some reason. Where are we building? Not entirely sure why. Don't I have a barracks? Didn't. I don't know why. We ride for the glory of Gondor. Swords. Knights. More knights. Knights. Uh, archers. Well, they're not so good against me. Rout the enemy. What? Oh, an enemy is back feeding. Darkness covers our land. Somehow. I think that was before Avenir destroyed their um Away! Their furnace, so that means that Wow, lag. Let's go. What in the world? Yeah, I think that was before Amir destroyed their furnace, so we didn't the get the XP. Whoa, what is going on? Um Okay. That was interesting. Riders of Rohan! Ride! That's not a logical thing. Somebody called a rider to Prepare the battle! Draw your sword! Knight one! Here we probably will be shot. Even on the normal snaps. Yep. And I get one um, Rally resource the night. Per, per kill. We'll claim this area. Level two barracks. Oh! Level three one. Oh, together, so man! This might be a good opportunity for the Uh, now I just need to find out where the fortress is. Ah, huh. right there. Die, builder. Standing. Really contributing much. Prepare for battle. Oh, hey. together. They don't. Where am I chasing? Am I chasing someone or just randomly? Push on! You 
deal with a mountain giant. Can't do it. Good AMR is not considered a minor hero, apparently. So he can't be um, knocked back. You can count on me. Wow. Okay, you just threw rocks at it. Oh, die. Do it again. Hobbits are good against... <laughs> Apparently hobbits are good against mountain giants, not against goblin archers. <sighs> Yay, peasants! Knights of Minas Tirith! We are playing this area! Guys can come in and help out somewhere else. Gandalf, drive I it have failed you! These guys. Men of Gondor. Gondor soldiers. I think most of that was just like allies, forces. So now I have a decent force for next time they attack me. A decent defensive force. And I don't care about stats, it's just a minor battle. Uh, yeah, I'll keep them all. Uh, except the soldier. Uh, no. Actually, that puts me in the negative. I'll just keep the cheap ones. So I keep this. And... Okay, yeah, so I have... Someone in. So my allies shouldn't be able to die. Really. I'll join in the attack, why not? Nothing else can attack me, and if they do try to attack, I, I'll be pushed back so it's not like we'll swap and they'll take this somehow. Um, I need more... Actually, I don't really need too much, but they're useful. And Aragorn... an enemy, so I'll move there. And I'll be able to take it. Oh, no. Unless Gothmog attacks. And hopefully the Witch King will attack. No. If the Witch King attacks me, I can just destroy him. Oh, right. Not these two. So, no point in real timing. I mean, I might be able to win, but if so, it would take way too long and it's not that important. And, uh, uh, I should be able to win this, I believe. Yeah, fortresses are stronger than one hero. You need a couple of troops to destroy a fortress. At least. Like here. Yay, all auto resolves. Long boring battles. Real time battle. And, no. Well, one guy lost the unit, but okay. Oh well. Um. Oh wow, they have fewer territories than I do. They're doing pretty badly. <laughs> We've lost a territory. Half? Where? Oh. Gap of Rohan. Hopefully somebody attacks Isengard so they can defend it. Save. I have 
for it, Gandalf? No. Okay, I don't think I do. Actually... This may be a little bit on the whiskey side, but I think I'm going to bring Thaden back because there's a, quite a bit of territory between here and here and here, which is where the nearest enemy is. So, if it looks like they're making a push over there, then I'll try, I'll try to save it. But and here again, I can't really win. However, they don't seem to have any secret weapons, I don't think, so I probably took out a unit, hopefully. Yeah, they lost two units. That'll be annoying for them. And Isengard, I'm sure I can auto-resolve again. <laughs> auto-resolve is amazing. And, oh well. I have to real-time. Sadly. So, back in a second. And I'm back. <coughs> okay, so this time, instead of trying to, like, get, um, Let's get working. what are they called? There's a good, place. good things. Tools ready. <laughs> the Knights of Dol Amroth or anything, Let's so I can it. actually, like, be able to beat them. I'm just gonna try to ramp up my archers, build as many Athelian rangers as possible, and then... Whoops. Um... And then just try to make them surrender, hopefully. Ideally. Because if I get a strong enough army, they should resign, hopefully. I wonder how much else this one. Four hundred. Sending out some units, should be able to get close. They don't have heavy armor or anything. And they're put on offensive stance. And I can change the stance because this game is buggy. Although if I switch away, switch back, I think. Yep, they're back to defensive. I mean, for all I know, it could just be a visual bug and it doesn't actually change their stance. But it seems like. I know what we need. Oh, not even oh. Let's build it. I accidentally had the touchpad on. I hate touchpads. Well, they're useful if you don't have a mouse, but if you do have a mouse, then that's your point. Yay, arrow volley. Let's get working. Farms in? Wow, Let's 93%. Incredible. Incredible. We've improved the archery range. There. And then once you're done with that, you can find the battalion of Thelians, and then we'll get you under the flaming arrows. I love Helm's Deep because you have so much income. You have three inns, or outposts, I think. Yeah. Um, and room for, like, two perfect farms and one or two decent farms. It's one of the best defensive um, Watch your backs. places possible. What are you doing? What? No. What? No. Okay. <laughs> Do that. What have you done? Yeah. We've completed this one. Okay, I have a farm. Not gonna waste any more resources on anything else. After that. We've improved the archery range! Who needs something built? Yeah, because none of these are useful. Marketplace is okay because it has the Grand Harvest, which gives plus 10% resources. I'm just doing this to annoy, annoy you guys. <laughs> um, yeah, it has an upgrade that gives you plus 10% resources, Where but the marketplace costs 1,500 to build, 
and that upgrade costs 1500 so that's a total of 3,000 resources you just spent on that for plus 10% resources, which means you need to earn 30,000 resources for it to pay off. Not sure if I did this morning, but... Hopefully I haven't. Okay, now train as many as possible. And set the rally point. I don't know why I didn't already have that set. Was this Lurt's design? Thanks. Actually, who's their fourth hero? Let's see. Saruman, Lurtz, Worm Tongue, and. Uh. Not Grish. Do they have like Grish? Oh, no, he Keep was. Heads down. This way! Hmm. It'd be cool if they had Ubu. That's a scout for Gondor. But I think Lurtz kind Did of replaced Ubu. Keep an arrow ready. <laughs> Watch your back. Yeah, who is their fourth hero? Oh yeah, Sharku. So, I'm pretty sure that the person attacking me was either Saruman, Sharku, Lurtz, or Wormtongue. Come Rangers, let us scout for Gondor. It's not like there aren't any other options. It's obviously a reasonable guess. So, if they do surrender at the like couple minute mark, like seven minutes mark, right the world, and that should be in a couple, Let's build it. in about maybe two, two or three minutes. Keep producing. I need more. Come, Rangers, let us scout for Gondor. See like a counter of how many minutes it's been since up it started. Keep a lookout. Okay. Move you guys are supposed to be up there with the rest of them. This structure's ready. Nope, can't go over a thousand hit points. Stop! S. Rangers. Yeah. You too, same thing. Get in to position and then stop. Right Let us scout by, for Gondor. by yourself, yay! The enemy could be near. Oops, to outfit. Our resources run low. Uh -oh. I can't produce resources as fast as I can build the Thelian Rangers. I don't think. Ah, uh, maybe. Although I think that's gonna actually max me out. Is there what seventy two? Yeah. Hm. Keep an arrow ready. And... Come, Rangers, let us yep. scout for Gondor. Don't know why Do that one group went into the wrong place. Okay, you gonna send anything at me? 
or surrender. Hopefully. We got work to do. Maybe. One of the two. Please. Second arrow ready. Come, Rangers. Let us scout for Gondor. What's the hotkey? W. W. D W. I get the summon Dunedain allies. I think I'll summon them and if they haven't already surrendered. Okay, so Come, Rangers, let I us think scout for Gondor. Flag is causing me to run at about two thirds speed. Which me and it's been I think ten minutes so far. So if I was right about the seven minute mark thing, like being at that point they can surrender, they should be surrendering within two minutes or so. Maybe. Approximately. Oh, I can get Ithilian Rangers faster than I can um, produce them. Come Rangers, let us scout for Gondor! Okay. Now. In fact, let's see, I think that's 136. Is that? So that's only enough for another two. Just surrender already. You can't win. Wow. Why? Oh. They're just out of order. It looked like half of them were dead or something. Oh, right! Yeah, These could be guys all have the lucky well, shot ability if I build a blacksmith. Come or right, I can come come out. Out. We got work to do. Yeah, if I build a blacksmith and get Time the um, upgrade, on look out. the banner carrier, then I'll be able to use the lucky shot. Although, actually, a couple of them already have no, Just one of them already has lucky shot. Why are you going down there? That doesn't look. That this looks way. like a bad sign. After that, go there. Execute. Leave no trucks. I probably could have just clicked. I didn't need to go into planning mode, I don't think. But it's a fun Watch your backs! Message? But a fun I don't know how to describe it. Oh wow. Really? Oh yeah. I'm four command points short of or no. I'm fourteen command points short of being able to build enough. Yay! Or wait. No, I think I'm eight command points short. Yeah, I'm eight command points short of being able to build another unit. But it works. So yeah, I'm guessing that that was about the same time. Also, I now have a full force of Athelian Rangers. I should never need to do anything in Helm's Deep again. I can always just real time and wait, I think. Yay. So. I don't think that's exactly the same time, but it's probably roughly the same time. Maybe it's like there's some triggering thing that takes roughly t um, five minutes, like once they get a fortress up or something like that. Um, yeah, yeah, I know I, I'm gonna exhaust my treasury, but I don't care. Our realm has diminished because I get Helm's Deep permanently. Oh hey, I actually have my capital back for once. <laughs> and build 
farms everywhere. Attack! There it is. You can attack! And, oh, Boromir? Guess what? Attack! And you too, eh? Uh, yeah, there's no major threat. It, there's no way Azog can defeat four Rivendell Lancers, a Linden Horse Archer, and four Mithlon Sentries. And no one else can get there in time, except Drogoth. So yeah, um, I'll save that, the rest of that, for the next episode, though. So thank you all for watching, and see you next